to me. You see, when I die, that life will be better for you. Even when you know you're my only child, you still treat me this way. The fact that you're pregnant is a fate I've long accepted. But my problem is who is responsible? That's all I want to know. Thank God you heard what the doctor said. Tell me who is the father so he can sign for the operation. How many pregnant women have the same complication as you do? Tell me. Your mother, and you know I love you so much. I want the truth, my daughter. Just tell me, because I know my grandchild will not be fatherless. To me, please, please. It's okay. It's okay. Let me go get the water so you take your drugs. Everything will be all right. You know. Let your mom know. If, if my 
le monde. I don't understand. Why are you protecting this guy? Why not face the fact? I know what wants to happen. Come on, girl. I don't understand the sudden change since you met this guy. Better have you rethink. Vera. As I enter this room, just make this girl tell me the truth. I've tried to be harsh just to make her fearful and tell me the truth. But to no avail. God help me. I don't want to lose her. She's all I've got. Please, God, I beg you. How can my only child give birth to a bastard? Calling her since and she has refused to pick up. Yes, I I, I know we need in these people. Is that the reason why she she shouldn't pick my call? I don't know why she hasn't been picking my calls for weeks now. And the truth is, I, I love her so much. Yes, I know. I I I advised her to abort it at the early stage. She refused. And now the problem has started. And 
I don't know why she wants to make me look like a bad person. Please, I, I just need you to help me and talk to her. And why, why is she not picking my calls? You're the only one that can tell me. Why? Ken, Ken, do you know my advice for you? No, tell me. Just all these questions you asked me. Why not send it upstairs to Joy? And I bet you she will reply you. Joy, why, why, why can't you be serious for once? Do you think I'm joking? Ken, why not try? I, I've just given you the solution. Okay, you know what? In few minutes, if she doesn't reply, just call me. Alright? It's okay. Thank you. It's okay. It. Phone that is here with you. I can see there's something you're hiding. But you have heard this one. Let me. Unbelievable. Ken, I really do not understand you these days. You barely talk to nobody. You're always weak. Always moody. Okay, let me ask you. Hmm? What are you doing inside your room all alone by this time of day? Okay. I've been observing you little and I'm just reserving my comments. Mm. I know you've been observing me. But truth be told, something has been really eating me up. And I can't just die in silence. Ken, it's me. It's Junior. Okay? I don't know why you should hide things away from me, Ken. So, tell me, what's bothering you? Wait. Did I say something was bothering you? It's me. No, I just don't... Don't... See, let me just tell you, eh? If you like, tell me. If you don't like, keep it to yourself. Eh? Definitely, I'll find out. And I'll know the exact truth. Okay, so the better you tell me, the better it becomes. Okay. Okay. Pico. Joy is carrying my baby. Guy, why? What's wrong? 
laugh? Why they laugh? Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Ken, now you you of all people now you scared like this. MCC Junior, I don't like this. This is a serious issue and I, I don't know why you are laughing over it. I said I'm sorry. Okay, what happened? Tell me. That day, I was just looking for um, the, the house address where you people recently parked to. Okay. I was looking for the address. Okay. And then I met someone. I know it's somewhere around here, but I don't know where it's at. Hello? Hi! Sorry! What did you say? Um, please, sorry, I said I was back. Number 19, Chicky Street. Oh, you passed it already. It's just there, by the right, the first black gate. Okay, the, the first black gate right there. Thank you very much. Wait! My name is Joy. Oh, Joy. Pardon my manners. I'm Ken. And I must say, you look beautiful and so nice. Are you serious? Well, I'm here. <laughs> hey, tell me something, tell me something. Are you serious? Talking to my new friend. Okay. Yes, I am. You're quite funny. <laughs> really? Mm -hmm. I want to know you more. So tell me about yourself. Well, um, there's nothing much to know. My name is Kenneth Abajamba. I'm the only child. And, um, my mother is late. That's so passionate. It's okay. It's okay. And um, I graduated from nursing and well, enough about me. Now, let me hear about you. Tell me about you. <laughs> well, you are almost even, you know. My name is Joy.
I am a student of microbiology. Currently on holiday, I stay with my mom. My dad is late. I lost him when I was two. You and I seem to more like. What do you think? Why not? <laughs> it's okay. Just send me the address. Okay, I'll do that right away. You know, Joy, I really admire your courage because I know it's not every Nigerian girl that would go for what she wants. I mean, telling a guy that she likes him, I really, really admire your courage. I love her and I feel this great bond whenever we are together but I never wanted to have sex but when she leaves I feel so empty within that was how I knew I loved her and she loves me too we continued with our love but you know how it is you know I'm the only one, always at home. If dad were to be around, then the case would be different. Then, a day came, and something happened there. But I, I, I just can't explain. I never want to see her again. Why? Because of what happened. Though before she left, I... Ah! You are still not ready. Please be fast. Let's go see Dr. Cheka before we go see Dr. Harrison. You know we are still making a second opinion. We must really see all these doctors only today. Yes, we have to. Remember Dr. Harrison gave me time. And it's a good opportunity to see Dr. Chick as well. We should have gone earlier than now. now. My dear, mm -hmm. we are still seeking for second opinion. I beg you in the name of God. Who is Cain? I just need the truth. Just tell me the truth. Oh, not now. I don't need any visitor. Just, just hurry up, hurry up.
destroyed much more. I'm so sorry intruding into you today. The truth is, I'm sure you don't recall me at all. But don't worry. I remind you. My name is Dr. Peters. In the Christabel Hospital. The hospital where you gave birth to some years ago. Oh sir. You're welcome. Thank you very much, Ma. So what can I offer you? Oh, thank you very much, Ma. You're so kind. Nothing now. Okay. Madam, I have sinned against God and sinned against you. I am not worthy to be alive. Please. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, forgive me. Forgiveness? I should forgive you. Jesus. Wait. Don't tell me you are dragging me back to 23 years ago. What you said is true. You actually had a set of twins, a boy and a girl. I said it. I wish my husband is alive today to hear this. Now, where is my son? A set of twins. Even the scan showed it was a set of twins. And after everything, I found out it was one. Just one. I was sure. I tried to make case that your father said I should stop because of what I went through. I almost gave up after delivery. And today, this man is here to tell me that all everything is true. Let me calm down. Whatever you call yourself, if you know what is good for you, Oh 
die. We'll come up with someone new up there. Oh, hello. Alright. I'm okay. Let's have a go. Please, um, could you pass me that cool? What's your problem? You keep dressing like a woman. What's your hey, problem? give me comb. I don't finish. Give me a I gotta take something. I gotta do this stuff going on here. How are you? Very fine, thank you. Okay. What? Come inside. Mm. What are we doing? I don't need this place to open up. Come here. No, come on, come inside. Small Oga! No, what? Wait. Is this the house of the doctor we were supposed to see? Dr. Chica. Oh, Dr. Harris. What is wrong with you? Keep quiet. Are you are here looking at me like moron? What are we doing here? Yes. What are we here for? Um. Uh, um. This 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 is where your son lives with his adopted parent. My son. Yes, ma. Where is he? Hey, wait. You seem to know these people too well. Do you know the name of the boy? What is his name? Um, that's him. John! 